everyone I hope you're doing great today today's video is just gonna be a quick maintenance and an upgrade on my style this is gonna be fixing my hair as you see it's all grown out I hope everyone is feeling great today I have been a little bit in my A uh, on posting November and December are just really busy times for me Alright guys, I decided to do the rest of this in a voiceover being that I was not feeling too well on the day I did record this um, As you see my hair had really grown out a lot of new growth Whoa, as I stated there. Yeah, I hadn't tied it up this day or probably just laying around and I was like hey it's time to do something to your head, girl. So I'm going to take the side braids out and just figure out something different to do to jazz this up just a little bit. This is going into week number three for me for this style. So the camera hair, as I always stated when I get the questions, it holds up. It does not mat. It does not tangle. Uh, the proof is right there in the pudding. As you see, I just paddle brush it and I spray water on it to just help loosen up those curls and make them pop right back and you might have to cut the very end sometime because they do get kind of I'm not gonna say hard but they just feels not as soft as it was in the beginning but it really doesn't bother me <clears throat> excuse me but I did notice the other hair that I have on the exposed side that hair is a lot different than Kimma. I would not advise to use Bishi if you are in this for longevity because it's definitely going to not mat, but the fibers are a lot different. Kimma's fibers are a lot softer than um, the Bishi. I don't know, I'm gonna have to look at the packs to see what the difference is, but Kimma is like 150 million percent better. Uh, everything is beeping. Sorry guys. I'm cooking in the air fryer in the oven and everything is beeping all at the same time but um, I'm gonna shut up talking right now and I'm just let you watch and just stay tuned to the end for the finished results because I did end up doing something different just to show how versatile this style could be but I'm going to hang it up for a little bit and go into something different here on my next upload Life has been really busy right now, so I haven't never gone this long without posting. I think it's been almost three weeks, but just hang in there with me. I promise I have an abundance of content planned for next year. I already have a lot of things that I'm going to be sharing, and I'm going to try to get on a better schedule to where I'm not posting too much, but not too less. You know if it makes any sense, but I don't want to overwhelm myself uh, with trying to you know edit because that's the part I still have trouble with and because of just time uh, I have so many videos recorded but I'm like I have to edit all this stuff so yeah so on to me doing my hair all right guys All right, all of the braiding hair is out. This is my hair. It is dyed the same color as the weave. So I'm gonna spray a little bit of water on my hair. It is kind of dry. I just have some grease. I like to use this. For moisturization when I have braids in. It just stays in. Better than me. These edges. Push that back. Let's see how this will look just brushed down.
I think I really want to do this. Just brush it down. Alright, I forgot to show you how to uh, pineapple, but I just went ahead and put this little piece of hair in the twisty. I do pineapple this hair. So I'll show you how I do that. Just bring it all to the front. Get your tie. Make sure everything is in there. You can kind of feel around and look and push up. And I just tie it really loosely. You can leave it like this or All right, through the magic of video, this is the next morning. I dampened my hair just a little bit, and I used wet line gel to get it really, really sleek. And I used the clip to secure it once I did get the um, hair as sleek as I wanted it. I did secure it also with an, an elastic band. Um, I really could have plaited it, but like I said, I had that cut on my finger. So, yeah, as you see, my band aid, like my braiding capabilities were kind of interrupted. So, that's why this towel actually lasted as long as it's lasting. Um, and I just used my fingers to get it really, really sleek, along with the old brush there. I just used for my edges. They're growing back in quite well. And the braids did start to push back, as you see there in the front. But this is a way just to extend the life of your style for another week or maybe even two weeks. Just be really gentle with it. Um, if you have any loose braids like that one there, just pull it back. Um, and I had to just like play around with that front area because I pulled a, that whole braid up on accident. But I really like how that part still looks. It's very defined, not as grown out. And I just put my butterfly clip there just to hide any exposed braids in that area. And that's basically it. This is actually like maybe two days later after I did that. I think. Or maybe even three. But all I do is tie it up again in that pineapple you saw me do. And I will just sleek it down a little bit in the morning. And I did wear this for another week and a half. Um, it was just time to take it down like my scalp was getting really itchy you see me just scratching right there but it just got really itchy but like I said it's camera hair uh, the longevity of it is just like amazing but that bishi uh -uh, I won't be using that again I think I got like four packs of that hair left I'm going to just do some regular braids with it um, not gonna be doing crochet with that beachy hair. So if you like this little revamp, refresh of a, of your old crochet braids, give it a like. Get some type of engagement to keep the content being pushed. Get my videos recognized. I've grown quite a bit, and I do want to thank all my new subscribers. I hope you are enjoying my content. Keep coming back. Keep encouraging me to post. Even though I did have a little bit of a drought just due to, like I said, the holidays. After Christmas, just get ready. A whole lot of things in store. Like, comment, subscribe. Keep engaging and sharing and coming back for more. See you guys in the next one. Peace out.